Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some popper slivers, and we are up against Baldo90, but he's been taking his time uh, deciding whether or not to play first. So I don't know what's going on with that. Hopefully he stays in and starts playing fast. Uh, but I even delayed starting to record because he was taking his time, but I got anxious. I pressed record. We're here now. You're here with me. Now you get to suffer through who knows how long of Baldo waiting to start. Who would play like this? Anybody play like this? Just a little. <laughs> I even give that option. There's no point. All right. He proceeds to take his draw, and we have an unkeepable hand. Mulligan. Okay. Keep. Dump. Done. Don't need that Ash Barons right now. We got our mana fixing in the gem hide. And they play Secluded Steppe. Works for me. Uh, be nice to get another one drop, I think. Chancery, all right, we're grooving. Honestly, I might just, what is this, familiars probably? This is familiars. I may just want to put down lords for a second. Yeah, there's no point to putting down Gemhide yet. We'll have a better use of him in the upcoming turns when we have more of a board. Let's just get in for damage while we can. Start racing all their walls if this is familiars. Lots of cards. Start playing them. Medic Prism. Drawing a card. You're going to have to discard the hand size now. Oh, nope, you had a Thriving Heath. All right, good. Chosen is red. Red. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Hmm. All right, play him. Play that. I think we just go Thriving Grove, calling blue, and we dump our hand here. Because if they're calling red, that means they're probably going to try to take out creatures next turn if they have removal in red. So I'm just going to get out of range of a lightning bolt or something. Take a turn off, and then we'll swing in for some massive damage next turn. And we got plenty of mana, plenty of refill. And by plenty, I mean one. So we're in a good state. Uh -uh, what else could this be, though? Ancient Den. What the frick? Journey? Oh, no. Okay. Fair enough. Don't double journey me. There's the lightning bolt. Dang, everybody's got new artwork, man. It's crazy. All right. It's on to the lead the stampede. Another one? Don't take out my gem hide. Bodge. Good place. Good place. Smart. Very smart. We got double lead the stampede though. Do appreciate that. Um, maybe I should have hold it up planes, but we'll see. Thank goodness we've got double lead the stampede. Honestly. All right, three sources of removal though are gone. Which is nice. Get in there for one. See what else they got. Let's see if they're going to start playing some creatures. Some core sky fishers or something. Huh. Did I call it or what? Come on, if you're playing Ancient Den in any type of white, you're probably playing core sky fisher. Redrawn. That's fine. It's going to give me a turn to set up with some double lords. Ooh, gosh, dang. So now you're playing with black? You're playing four colors? Okay. Lords for days. I'll take it. Let's get them down. Keep grinding it out. I think we're going to need all the protection from the sideboard here. It's just the feeling I'm getting. Seem really control heavy. 
Let me land this. Swing away, Meryl. Swing away. Get in. Baldo, Baldo. Yeah, another... Okay, Alchemist file. Can't attack or block. They can start setting up with that. If they need to. Another core. Bouncing Prophetic again. But they can't replay it this turn. Unless they have a land. Do they have a land? They didn't play one this turn. But no, it doesn't look like it. Give me a land so I can... It's not the land I was looking for, but okay. So, I think we just slam Lord. Looks good to me. Get in. Start forcing them to block. They take eight. Fair, fair. Molly D coming in. Drawing them tons of cards, I'm sure. But they are tapped out, so let's lead the Stampede into another Lord. Just keep replacing Lords, I guess. Thriving. Holy cow. I'm gonna tap this one. Alright, we got a Lord. That's fair. Oop. There you go. Keep the force blocks coming. Taking four, go to two, clearing the board, six cards in hand. I'm not saying they can't do anything, but it's going to be very difficult. I got to take out all my lords. <laughs> Prophetic prism. Time to dig deep. Come on, Baldo. Seven cards in hand. Concession? Concession. Sideboard. All right. Benevolent, you're in. Mass Vandal, you're in. Prismatic? Maybe one? Striking, you're out. Winged, you can definitely stay in Sentinel. I don't really need you as much as the rest. Um, we can cut one gem. We can cut one winding. I don't really want to cut any windings, though. That's the problem. What don't I need? I want my plateds. Maybe one sidewinder. Yeah, we could do with cutting one sidewinder. Do I need prismatic, though? I can. I have mass vandal to take out their journeys, and I've got benevolent to start protecting against lightning bolts. I kind of do want to leave one prismatic in, but what to cut? What to cut? Art. Like heart too much. Maybe we just play with two masked vandals. Uh, I want to be able to draw into those. I like the plateds, but maybe it's not as necessary as I'm thinking. Tough decision. Heart, do I need you? Also predatory. I want to be fast. I want to be as fast as possible. Let's cut one more sidewinder. Go two play to two sidewinder. Benevolent two of. And Mass Vandal three of. One of Prismatic. Seems a little awkward. Let's run it. See so yeah, how we do. Got 
gotta take his time deciding if he wants to play first again. What would you like to do, sir? Okay, uh, very capable start. Could be a little bit faster, but hey, I'm not gonna complain. Keep. Untapped land would probably be best, obviously. Usually is, but. They are gonna do Thriving Call Black. Mm, bringing in some black removal, are we? Okay, forest. I still have to go thriving here. I gotta call white. Pass. Good news is if they brought in some edicts or something, we can play around those with next turn. So, fine with that. Den. Into Skyfisher already. That's reasonable. Predatory's good. We're just gonna get down... Our little guys here. Go. Three lords. I like it. Here comes the removal. And they're holding it up too. Wow, four lords. Holy cow. Um. Man, I wish I had a gem hide right now. We cut one too, didn't we? <laughs> All right, well, these things are going to start dying eventually, so we might as well get the ball rolling. Uh, I'm not feeling like attacking, though, because I know they're holding up Bolt, and it just seems silly to me to trade off two creatures. Holding it? What? Interesting. Probably still would have taken it out. Well, now we're going to force their hand. All right, Journey, that's fine. Ah, I need an untapped land. I want to play double lords next turn and get out of range. Well, now I can't really. They are going to just strike something instantly. Come on, give me something good. Other winding ways, not bad, but... Wanted more than that. Pass again. Don't like passing, but... Again, there's no point in trading out like this wouldn't even be a trade out they would just eat my creature Prophetic prism sure it's fine if they're just gonna do nothing else and just hold up great furnace then okay they're gonna go ahead and take advantage of the blast now that's good they're tapped out for a turn we're gonna play land four cards in hand journeys out where's our masked vandals masked vandal is lit against journey say we we just get two creatures oh holy Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait, did they exile him? Where's my graveyard? Exiled. How does he get exiled? That's exiled, but they killed. What am I missing? Oh, Bajookabog exiled it. Okay, fair enough. I forgot about Bajookabog exiling the graveyard. Uh, fair play, fair play. Uh, but that's okay. We got plenty we can do, and we can a swing in this turn at least. For one turn. Itinna. Yeah. Onward. This game's a wrap. Come on. I do just want one more land, though. One more land next turn would be lit. Like, say, one more land. They take out our predatory. We go predatory mass vandal, exiling our predatory, get back sinew, and then we're just pff, game over. Four cards in hand, though. Let's see. They've used... Two pieces of removal on us. Glinthawk. Yep. Popping back. Ancient Den. Oh no. Prophetic. All right. Gonna keep Tron. They're tapping that red source. Still got black up though. But now I'm less worried about black. All right. Thriving Bluff. Calling white. Give me a land. Actually, I don't really care anymore. Holy crap, the winding ways are ridiculous right now. We just, we're in complete control of this game. There's nothing they can do right now. I... I'll just swing in right here. I'll do that. 
I do want to get something in my graveyard, <laughs> honestly. So if they want to double block something, it's chill. Uh, we will take out or Skyfisher. They can, of course, now Lightning Bolt something, which maybe maybe that was a misplay, honestly. But I'm not super worried. We've got a lot of refill. Yeah, maybe that was a misplay. They might they probably just got more galvanics and stuff, so. Yep, there we go. Yeah, misplay. Ooh. Fun fun. Alright, we're still gonna have a good turn, because we are gonna mass vandal into getting our sinew back. Prismatics, cool. Buy this. Back to me, you come. And they are the monarch, which is problematic. I could become the monarch. Unless they want to chump block with both, but I doubt they'll do that. Let's go ahead and pass. Still missing out on that, that fourth land, man. That'd make our turn so much more beneficial. So now we're open to more removal. They got five cards in hand. They're going to draw another one. Molly D. I keep holding up this black. Like, why wouldn't you hold up a red source for another Galvanic? Yes, Glint. But they already played a land. They just want... They're getting extra greedy with that Prophetic Prism. Monarch nonsense. Alright, they got a board. They definitely got a board. Benevolence. Is what it is. Let's go ahead and finally get these winding ways out, shall we? Muscle winged. That's fine. Get out benevolent. At least give us protection for one turn. Then we're gonna start taking to the air. Start going against all these glint hawks and stuff. So much card draw though. land. Fair enough. Another Molly D. Holy cow. That's insane. I keep tapping the red though, so that's good. Maybe they're digging for another journey. All right, land slammed, winged, and muscle. Let's go. Come on. They have to discard now. Ah, benevolent. I mean, benevolence chill. It is chill, honestly. Let's get in. Let's see how they do their blocks. They want me to have the Monarch. Don't want me to have the Monarch. They can't like double up on everything. Holy cow. They really want this guy dead, don't they? Holy cow. I mean, I'm fine with this. Let's take out their Palace Sentinels. They're doing it because of the Benevolence, but I'm not going to fall for it. They can eat one of my Lords, and we're just going to hold up the Benevolence for everything else. We're going to get another card draw. It's 
fine by me. We're going to start getting some poisonous down. They are at five poisonous now. I think it's more important to hold these up on their turn. Another Lord, still not finding our land. We threw one away with a winding way, but like, dang, it's crazy that we've just been drawn into so much gas, especially when we want like one more. <laughs> Seven cards in hand, though. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. Add another one. That's fair. I kind of figured that, too. I was kind of thinking about that. I'm like, they're chump blocking with him and then putting everything on it. I think they're baiting me into, like, doing this. Uh, but let's see. Um, Wing Sliver doesn't win here. Almost does, but not quite. Actually... I think we just win. Uh, no. No, 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 not quite. Oh. Crap. That's not good. Let's see if they know how to stack it right. We can save a few things. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yup. When are you going to let it go, though? Right here? Alright. We're going to protect you. Red. I'm going to protect you. Fair. Okay. Still got two creatures. They're going to get in for a little bit. Get their monarch back. Masked Vandal. Hmm. So many cards in hand and we can't draw our land it's ridiculous i almost want a winding way for just a stinking land it's crazy Now, I guess we just go Lord here. It's the best we got right now. In this awkward spot. They got so many cards in hand. Gold Meg. Draw a card, you gain three life. Fair enough. Saving them right now a little bit. Alchemist can't block. They're going to start trying to be the aggressor. Galvanic. That's your thing. Okay. Two and sack. Okay. Just got to keep that in mind. Jemmy. Oh, what a beautiful babe. Thank you for helping us a little bit here. All right. So now, let's try to freaking do some stuff. I think I want to find a plated or something. Hmm. Throw it down. They don't know about our winged yet. They haven't seen it. 
Let's just hope our gem hide can survive, honestly. Because if it can't, we're still in a rough spot. If it can, we're in a great spot. We got fingers crossed here. They just have so much. They have another prismatic in their hand still that they pulled back a while ago. Oh, that's good. Golden egg. Two golden eggs, and they're gonna pop back golden egg probably. Keep on drawing. They're gonna mill themselves. This has been a really good game. A really good game. Oh, they're starting to get aggressive. Mm -hmm. Second guessing. Okay. Taking six for this turn. Take more lords, that's fine. Alright, let's start with lords. He comes down, good. Good, good. It's all really good. And then we throw down winged, slam the winged on him. That works for me. Uh, we do have to hold back though. Could, mm, don't really want to take the risk because they could lightning bolt our face at this point if they get in for certain amount of damage so we're gonna hold back blockers now we have flying we've got them at four fours they could have um they could have uh journey that would be that would just seal their win honestly right one two three yeah if they have journey here it's donezo but they're just gonna go vanic blast and then swing all right hey that was a good game that was a really good game there's no way we can win, right? One, two, two, four, six, eight. Yeah. Hmm. I guess conversely we could have held up prismatic, but it is what it is. Uh, that was a really good game, though. Let's go to game three. I still have uh, high hopes for what we're doing here. Do we want to make any adjustments? I want the gem hide back in. Uh, I mean, that saved us that game in, in a way. I mean, it brought us back in the game, at least. Uh, would I like to play first? Yes. And we cannot keep this. No. Mulligan. We can keep this. We'll get rid of winged for now. Keep. Dump. Done. We need to call white with this uh, but we can start doubling up on the viverlance which will be nasty they'll probably die before we get any crazy stuff going but that's a good I, I like to see that colorless mana turn one that's fine uh yeah let's just do the play and next turn we can go predatory into our second viverlant i'm just going to start with one for now because i do want to start building that defense Dang. All right. They got they got lucky with that furnace. Uh, we are going to get in for four poisonous, though. Okay. Good. Actually, didn't even consider that. But we're good. We're good. Okay. Two threes. 
They have two artifacts. So we're playing around Galvanic. We're not playing around Lightning Strike. But we do have them at four Poisonous. And if they want to target Lord, they're dead from Poisonous. So they have to target Poisonous, which means our Lord survives. If they're playing it smart. Or they just kill both. <laughs> that could happen too. But they're not gonna. Huck, we could just be sealing the deal right now. Let's go. Seal the deal. Journey? Glint. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Game over. Six Poisonous coming at you. It was a good game. Can't do anything else. I mean, that's six poisonous. Check this out. Ready? We're going to call blue. We're just going to rub it in. That was a well-fought second game, though. I will say, like, that was a really good game. Really, really good. All right, GG's. GG's, Baldo. Good stuff. I did like it. Hopefully you guys did, too. That was a really good game. And wow. Well, phone's going off. eBay's dinging me. I've got a lot of stuff coming in. If you guys watch any of my booster crackings, my Sunday booster crackings, make sure to stay tuned for that because I've got a lot coming in. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Thank you for staying tuned. If you made it all the way through this video, I think it was well worth it because that was some good gameplay. Leave a like, leave a comment, and see you guys in the next video.